Jager Vaughn in YouTube. Um, I am playing my Blue Line Bjorin. And I'll go through a quick little rotation here before we begin. Um, I use Slash, Biting Edge, which is an area effect, Slam, and um, Guarded Attack. Um, I use these. these are, this is what builds up my Wrath. And then um, I will use Thrash in order to switch over to Bear Form. And that'll let me use uh, Claw Swipe, which is another area effect, uh, Valiant Roar, or Vigilant Roar, Recuperate to start my healings, uh, Armor Crush, and then if there's a lot of them, I will do Thunderous Roar. Um, I will also throw on um, Hearten when I can, um, Thick and Hide is another one I like to use, and Thorned Armor. Um, if you want to switch from Bear Form as a little cheat, and human form, click yourself with F1. Then whatever your bear ability is, thrash, use that. Gotta switch you into a bear. Keep targeting yourself and then hit slash, and that'll turn you into a human. That's a quick little way to do that. Uh, then the bad thing out. Uh, so we're gonna be doing torch quests in here. There's obviously there's this one too, uh, vicious roar, which is it'll get you healed too. It's a morale recovery. Uh, most of my single target, I will probably just stay in human form. That is really one of the, the forms I stay the most in. As you can see, my wrath is up. If I decide to pull a lot or I beat a signature, I would probably drop in the bear. Uh, blue line is the tank line. Uh, gear, what's that? I have either buy it. Gotcha. We're talking about the treasure quests that are happening right now. And another thing is, if you are... Uh, part of the Lotro community. Uh, there is a code for the week until the, uh, April 11th. And it is um, Battle Restoration. Which will get you Battle Restoration. Potions. Alright. Looking around. Alright. This is just one. Okay, this one should have the the rock and stuff. Still getting these torches here. I'm just dousing them. Bum, bum, bum. We're looking for a ruin that's on the floor. There it is. You know what, now that my stuff is full, maybe I will go around in, in bear form here. And I am just using delete and U to target stuff without my mouse. So if you get close to an item, you can press delete and it will automatically target, you know, quest items, interaction items, things like that. It won't do characters and then I press U and that just uses it. So I'm mostly just using keyboard. Ah, right, here we go. Let's do bear. All right, we got all of those. Oh, that's why. I can't touch torches as a bear because I have no hands. They don't have thumbs, they only got big old paws. Uh, let's go this way. We should be able to go back up, right? Boom, boom, boom. Ooh, here's a big one. Oh, 
bum, bum, bum. All right, I don't think any of this matters. I'm going back up here. All right. Now, if I go to the left, I'm pretty sure two little rooms down is going to be the... Oh, we got... There we go. I saw the dread get on me. Yes, yes, you brought up, uh, Ink brought up a good point. There's a shortcut for flashlight, which is all F10. There it is. I obviously have to be a human to interact with anything. There we go. Now we just need a couple more torches. There's a big boy. Oh. I can't even tell. Oh, there we go. All right, one more. One more torch, and we can head out of here. Boom, boom, boom. There we go. Last torch. So yeah, you're just alternating in out of bear form, uh, human form to get your wrath up and bear form to waste it. To spend it, I guess, would be a better way of saying that. Ooh, trying to go for a heal there. All right. That would have been our last torch, but we're already finished. Now we're going to head out. I don't believe I have run this. I don't run a lot of instances. I do solo three and six man with like my tank characters, but no, I don't run a ton of them. That's usually how I test how sturdy a character is. I'll, I'll run an instance with them. Oh, okay. Um, and uh, thank you again, YouTube, and uh, see you later.